let's go on to the proofs of uh, certain set operations and uh, we'll also look at uh, uh, deriving a common method to uh, solve such cases. So, uh, first we are dealing with a <laughs> relatively simple case that so, um, set A minus set B is equal to set A intersection uh, set B complement. And as uh, already mentioned uh, in a previous video, uh, we usually solve such cases by uh, taking uh, uh, either the left side or the right side on by on and uh, coming up with a conclusion and then uh, going on to the final statement of uh, set A being a subset of B and set B being a subset of A which, which leads to the final derivation that is so uh, a is equal to p now in this particular case uh, also also the point uh, which ought to be looked into is that uh, <coughs> you have to choose two uh, two two arbitrary elements and uh, uh, in, uh, in order to avoid uh, <coughs> confusion uh, it's better to choose uh, two different elements and in this particular case uh, i am choosing x and y so let's begin with the uh, <coughs> a minus b that's uh, now uh, let, let x be an uh, arbitrary element of uh, the, the set found by a minus b. Now what is the meaning of a, a, a minus b means uh, set a minus set b means uh, those elements which are present in a but not present in b. So that that's simply means that uh, x is an element of a and x is not an element of b. <clears throat> which again means that uh, x is an element of, if x is not an element of b, then it, it should be an element of b complement. Naturally, that leads to the mm, conclusion that x is an element of a intersection b complement. Therefore, a minus b is a subset of a uh, intersection b complement. Now, Let's look at the other side and we are choosing uh, another arbitrary element and as I have already told, in order to avoid the conf confusion, we are taking it as y. So y, uh, let, let y be an element of a, uh, set a intersection b, set b complement and it simply means that uh, we are dealing with an uh, uh, intersection and uh, so uh, we are dealing with the common elements, it simply means that y is an element of A and y is an element of B complement. Now if y is an element of B complement, naturally y uh, cannot be an element of B. So that leads to the conclusion that y is an element of A minus B, uh, which implies that A index section B complement is a subset of uh, A minus B, is a subset of set A minus set B. Now, uh, as uh, as I already mentioned in the beginning of this particular section, when uh, when a set is uh, a subset of uh, another set and vice versa, we are dealing with equal sets, which simply means that we get the conclusion uh, that a minus b equal to um, a intersection b complement. Uh, thank you.